that when we apply power to it, input power, mm -hmm. we see more power coming out than what we put in. Is that like this a perpetual motion machine? Uh, that's, uh, this seems like not realistic. So, oh yeah. I, you know, I did see it's exactly. not electrical engineering, so what am I missing? Right. Well, yeah, I mean, there, there are a lot of, well, there's a few scams out there on the internet, okay, that kind of promote this technology. Yeah. I've been into it for about 15 years. So and how are you not so breaking the law of with, thermodynamics? Well, how you do it is that you, ac you access the negative time domain. Okay, with this technology. I can't tell if you're trolling me or not. No, it gets into quantum mechanics and special relativity. Can you, can you use small words for me? That's why we say it's the most advanced. You break this down to small words for me. Okay. Well, the middle description of it would be: we have the transformer. It's in a bifiler configuration. Okay, that acts on electron flows by setting up opposing forces okay. onto its electron flow, such that it behaves like a superconductor. Okay. okay, so superconductor, when I think of that, I think of like replacing batteries. So where are you selling this technology to? Well, you see, in superconductors, there's a quantum tunneling effect that's occurring, okay, in the material. And it's done by setting up opposing forces inside of the lattice. We're doing the same thing with our tech. Okay, that's so... That's what's so unique about this. So what kind of people would uh, end up, you know, putting, buying this, putting in their, you know, end products? The entire world. We have a trillion dollar market with this tech. There's no other product that can... This work on your this. face, I can't tell, again, if you're just messing with everyone no, watching or not. No, it's, it's so fantastic. It, I have to smile. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so who's funding this? Um, well, we do have a small group of investors. Okay. Uh, through Aurora's contacts, Aurora's my partner there, okay. and she would be the, the one to talk to for distributors, representatives, uh, people that would want to invest in a corporation. She would be the one to talk to. Okay. I'm just the tech guy. So what okay, products that, currently use this technology? Well, we want to put it in the scooter. Okay. Okay, which is right behind you. Why is a scooter a good point for uh, technology that could change the world? Uh, because it's easy to do. <laughs> Make something that seemingly breaks laws of physics, but this one's an easy implementation. Oh yeah, okay. yeah. It's an easy demonstrator. You know, now uh, I also give minimum demonstrations. Minimum viable product. Minimum viable product. I like your philosophy here. Now we also give demonstrations of the technology. Okay. Should we come back in some amount of time for the demo, or? Uh, well, we're giving it in our hotel room. I got the equipment set up there, where I show people that I put power in and I get more power out. Is that possibly a measurement error? No. No, because you see it actually on the oscilloscope where the phase angle literally goes over 90 degrees and it's just unheard of. There's just no other electrical device that has this kind of behavior. Have you showed this off at MIT or Berkeley or Stanford yet? Um, no. Why not? Uh, well, because we're just introducing it here at the show, so uh, you know that would be a, a future possibility. Okay. I mean, well, they can watch the video. Well, all right. Okay. Well, yeah. No, it's going to be live on TechCrunch. So, uh, okay. thanks for uh, the brief rundown. Okay. Very good. Thank you for stopping. By. Yep. Kyle. So I'm almost entirely certain that that's not real. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs>